For the final trade of the day, we have trader Tim Bigham with us now to help us kick off our Season 5 premiere. Good to see you there, Tim. Yeah, absolutely, and congrats, Ange, and uh, the rest of the Business First team for five years. Uh, certainly looking forward to many more after that. Well, thank you so much for being a part of our show. What's your view on the market conditions? Have you changed the way you trade? Yeah, absolutely, and uh, up until the last Fed meeting, uh, it really was pretty much a straight-up market where you bought every dip. Since that Fed meeting, we've seen this huge increase in volatility. So as the market changes, I think it's imperative as a trader to change along with that market. So I'm position sizing a little bit lower to account for the increased volatility here. So lower risk because of higher risk. Also not putting on the entire position at one time, waiting for the market. I think it'll give you an opportunity with this back and forth action to get into stocks at lower levels, get out of them at higher levels, using more of a trader's mentality than an investor's mentality, at least for the time being. Have you ever experienced a market like the one that we're seeing? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, the market changes. We've seen this time and time again. Certainly, I've been around for too long now, but, you know, we've seen it pretty much almost after every crisis out there where the market goes from quiet to uh, extremes, and then we'll calm down eventually here. So usually uh, at some point that volatility will ebb. Then you want to look to be back as an investor, less of a trader. What's your advice to investors? I think, uh, you know, use uh, the dips to be buyers here. Don't be as aggressive. Also, I favor with interest rates so low, looking at stocks that have a decent yield and some growth to them. So avoid maybe uh, the two ends that don't have a yield or heavy yielding stocks. The middle tier that yields about two to two and a half percent with some decent growth, I think will be the best place to hide out at least till the end of the year. Thank you, Tim. Thanks, Ann. For more Business First AM, check us out on social media. We're on Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter. And go to businessfirstam.com for where to see our show on TV.